Hey guys, good morning. How are you? Well, I'm getting ready for work. So, I just got out the shower. Um, and I said, let me just sit here and talk to you guys for a second while I'm getting myself together and all this fun stuff. Okay. Um, gonna have to do but anyway so i'm getting myself ready for work i'm oiling down all that kind of stuff hey so let's talk about it so um have any of you guys went to the bath and body works in my annual sale or ordered online have you ordered from pink victoria's secrets Lane Bryant has a semi-annual sale going on. That's good because a girl, listen, I got some big old boobies. And, um, yeah, I have to get my bras from there. And this is around the time when I get them, when they hit that semi-annual sale. Because I can't afford them when they're not on sale. So, girl, my bras be costing. But that's what happens. When you want good bras, you have to pay good money for your bras. I don't think any woman out there who have, um, you know, really big boobs should be wearing cheap bras. You should not wear cheap bras because you're going to be spilling out all over the place. I mean, it's, you're going to look like you got four breasts and extra meat on the sides. You don't want that. You want everything to be in the cup and covered. So that I don't, I don't mess with any bras from Walmart. Um, I just don't because they don't have anything that was that's for me. That's that the full coverage that I need. They don't have it there. Um, so I don't do it. Now, if you have breast size that you can go anywhere and get your bras, more power to you. I'm jealous, but it's okay. Um, hey, someone was born with more to love. And I'm just one of those people. <laughs> it's hereditary, you know. It skipped certain people in my family. Um, let me see. My grandmother has Oh, huge boobs. Uh, my mom didn't have huge, huge boobs. She had some boobs. So then she didn't really get those. But it, I got the huge, giant size boobs. Uh, my daughter, but I got big boobies like me. So it skips, you know, because my daughter, Alicia, she don't have big boobs at all. She don't. She thinks she do, but she really don't. And I told her... <laughs> <laughs> be happy with what you have, girl. Because at least you could buy your bras from any store you want to. So, or you have the choice on not to wear a bra. I don't have that choice. I have to wear a bra. Because if I don't wear a bra, listen, it's going to look like nighttime. I have this whole place covered. So, we're not going to do that. But anyway, um, it's Wednesday. You know, we halfway there. I'm excited for the weekend because my anniversary is Friday. Um, so what I got going on, I have a lot of things that I'm changing up that I got going on. Um, you know, for my channel, one is one of them. I've decided that on Sundays, that's what I'm going to do with my in the kitchen with phone Jones. And I'm going to be sharing recipes. I may have days where we talk about different recipes and we share recipes and stuff like that. And then I'll do my actual cooking and showing you what I made for dinner on Sundays. Um, my friend mail videos are going to be starting Friday. I will show what I have so far in the mail. But um, every Friday, when I get, whenever I get friend mail, I'm going to be showing it on Fridays. So that's Fridays is Jonesy mail. Um, see, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Well, you know, maybe... As for Dollar Tree days, I'm not going to really have a Dollar Tree day. Dollar Tree hauls are when my little bag is filled to the top. And that would be the day I'll do my haul. I'm not going to sit there and make a schedule for that because I'm not going to drive myself crazy. Um, and what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Um, more chat time and stuff like that. You know, just changing it up a little bit. And stuff like that. Um, I did want to speak to you guys about something. Because it's a lot of fakeness going on. 
And I thought that I was done with all of that stuff, but apparently not because, um, a, you know, a person who, you know, sold this and sold that, um, got this and got that, you know, did some old funny stuff. So I'm like, hmm, it doesn't make sense to even dwell on it but i you know what I, I watch people i watch how people move i watch how they form their little clicks i watch you know what i'm saying and i and i'm at the point now where i deal with you as as much as you deal with me if you don't say nothing to me i'm not gonna make come out my way to say anything to you that's just how it is you know i got my my my, my regular people that are always no matter what hey phone what's going on and i'm always bless them back and be like hey what's up what's popping and then you got the ones who only want to talk to you or want to be around you when it's convenient for them i'm not doing all that no no we're not we're not gonna do that so um that's gonna be done with but have y'all noticed that um and yeah i'm changing the subject real quick <laughs> have y'all noticed that dollar tree is already getting their valentine day stuff and so um, who, what, what other store? So it's Target. Um, I'm not really into a, I'm not really into Valentine's Day because, and not Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Um, I'm not really into that because, I don't know, I've never really been into Valentine's Day. It wasn't one of my favorite things. Um, I mean, it's a lot of stuff that says I love you and all this kind of stuff. I'm not sending y'all any of that stuff. I'm not going to, I'll probably do like a, maybe a pink and red pocket letter and find something to put on it for, you know, here and there. I'm not going to sit there and send you, I love yous and give me kisses. No, I'm not doing that. Y'all ain't getting that from me. We cool and all, but no. So, um, that's what that, but, but, but. My, I love um, St. Patrick's Day. Oh, St. Patrick's Day is one of my favorites because that's, I call it the green holiday. I always call it the green holiday since I was small because green is my favorite color. I love green. And I might, once I strip down my um, tree for the season, I might just do a St. Patrick's Day Christ tree. It's not going to be a Christmas tree, but I might do a St. Patrick's Day tree. I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to do that. Um, I might do a Mardi Gras tree as well. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm not sure. I know definitely the, the, the St. Patrick's Day tree I might do. So that's might be that's gonna be my little project for March. Um and also March is Shady Ray's birthday, and my son will be 25 March 2nd. He and and Shady Grady will be 50. March 23rd. He, he's having like a little get together. So I'm excited about that. Um, it's not going to be like too many people there. Just, just something cute and nice. Um, he got a lot of friends coming out of town. So it's going to be, it's going to be cool. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Can I talk to you about real quick before I go to work? What's something else I want to talk to you guys about? Hmm. Taste test, I might bring that back on Tuesday. Taste test Tuesdays. Um, I might switch it up. Have the boys do one, then I do one one week. So we probably, we, you know, we're going to switch it up. So I probably would bring that back. Um, but the only thing about it is they have gotten bored too <laughs> with a lot of the new stuff that's out. And they're like, hmm, we don't want to try it. So that's why I haven't been doing it because... They haven't been wanting to try a lot of stuff. So I'm not going to force them. So if they don't want to try, I'm not going to force them. But I might try some new wine on Tuesdays. I might try some new liquor. I might try whatever. So you never know. So I'm probably going to bring that back on Tuesdays. Um, starting the new year. And what else? What else? What else? That's it, guys. I think that is it. That is it. That is it. Well, I'm going to get in here and put my parachute on with me, my bra. And um, I'm going to holler at y'all later because I got to go to work. Ciao.